cyberspace domain to include the electromagnetic spectrum is and will be a critical area for any future conflict or period of competition. The United States Army and our joint partners must evolve to stay one step ahead of our potential adversaries in this rapidly changing and complex world. Near-peer nation states and motivated individuals possess impressive capabilities in the cyberspace domain. They can hide their true intentions and they can degrade our mission command capabilities. Unless we continuously evolve in this space, it is likely we will lose the ability to shape the fight at the time and place of our choosing. We must gain and maintain windows of advantage in the cyberspace domain to overcome current and emerging threats. We must also enable the maneuver commander to seize the initiative and pose multiple dilemmas to any adversary. By leveraging industry innovation, we can rapidly acquire capabilities and get them into the hands of our soldiers. The tools, technologies, and techniques required for mission success in the cyberspace domain are perpetually evolving and no one organization has the total solution to any one challenge. We must learn by doing. That is why the U.S. Army Cyber Center of Excellence, based here at Fort Gordon, created CyberQuest. CyberQuest is a world-class, Army-level prototype assessment, conducted in an operationally relevant environment with government, industry, and academic partners. The mission is to identify innovative technologies, tactics, techniques, and processes and force development proposals across the cyber domain. The results of this rigorous and objective experiment help to provide the evidence base for program of record requirements and increase the rapid acquisition of cyber, signal, and electronic warfare capabilities to support the warfighter. This year, the experimentation force comprises representatives from 1st of the 75th Cavalry Squadron, of 101st Airborne Division, Air Assault, the Cyber Protection Brigade, Army Reserve Cyber Operations Group, 335th Signal Command, 7th Signal Command, US Army Garrison Fort Gordon, the Intelligence Center of Excellence, and the Maneuver Center of Excellence. The exercise also has participation from the Joint Force as part of a deliberate development of CyberQuest this year. Strategic Command, US Army Special Operations Command, and the United States Marine Corps have all played a key role in the development and the execution of CyberQuest 2018. These Department of Defense organizations and participating vendors have made the journey to CyberQuest over a 12-month period, from initial calls for entry through technology selection and multiple integration events. 21 vendors provide technology and products which enable the exercise environment. They've committed significant time and resources to ensure that CyberQuest is an experiment of the highest quality. Realism is delivered using fielded program of record network capabilities, a live brigade combat team tactical operations center, a live dismounted maneuver force, an active cyber red team, and a full modeling and simulation wrap. This allows us to effectively evaluate the full range of cyberspace domain capabilities, from man pack electronic warfare to offensive cyber. CyberQuest doesn't just say what a soldier feels about a technology. It tells you what the Cyber Center of Excellence knows about how it's likely to operate in a brigade combat team context through the use of an instrumented network and data analytics to examine the outcome of each experiment activity. During CyberQuest 18, soldiers use cutting edge technologies to address four major objectives. The first objective is to assess technologies which help brigade combat team commanders gain and maintain the initiative across the cyber electromagnetic activity capability domain in a degraded or contested environment. The use of targeted electronic attack and offensive cyberspace operations will become critical tools to help commanders pose dilemmas to the adversary. The second objective is to identify cyber electromagnetic activity capabilities that help brigade combat team commanders gain positional advantage in and across multiple domains. The third objective is to understand how primary brigade combat team staffs can utilize cyber, electromagnetic activity capabilities to support situational understanding and targeting. Finally, CyberQuest 18 investigates how the Army can leverage the network enterprise and synchronize our multi-echelon forces, such as the cyber protection teams, to defend expeditionary networks operating in a degraded or contested environment. Here at the Cyber Center of Excellence, we are dedicated to providing our Army and the Joint Force with the critical capabilities required to maintain and extend our superiority in the cyberspace domain. The Cyber Center of Excellence, with all our mission partners, are charged to deliver a trained workforce, validated operational concepts, 
and critical capabilities that will enable our future cyber force to fight and win against any potential adversary. CyberQuest 2018 is a venue that will help us get there.